Hello everyone. Hope you are doing well. I'm going to explain this question in this video. The question says a man first swims in sea water and then in river water. एक आदमी पहले sea water में swim करता है फिर river water में करता है. Question A. Compare the weight of sea water and river water displaced by him. कितना water वो displace करेगा weight के हिसाब से sea water और river water में. Second question B. Where does he find easier to swim and why? किस में वो easy feel करेगा swim करने के लिए sea water में या river water में? हमें reason देना है. Let us see answer. Sea water has salt that increases its density while river water river water does not have salt according to according to archimedes principle archimedes principle according to archimedes principle when a body is partially or fully immersed in a fluid in a fluid it experiences it experiences an upward and upward buoyant force buoyant force force equal to the weight of the equal to the weight of the liquid displaced liquid displaced the weight of the liquid the weight of the liquid obviously obviously depends on depends on the volume and density volume and density of the of the displaced liquid displaced liquid we can say we can say weight of sea water sea water displaced is greater than river water river water let us go with question b in b question we need to say that greater the density in b question what can we say greater the density easier to swim in b question we can say that from the relation from the relation buoyant force is equals to buoyant force is equals to volume of the liquid into density of the liquid into acceleration due to gravity we can say we can say that we can say that buoyant forces buoyant force is directly depends on directly depends on density of liquid 
density of liquid thus sea water sea water has salt in it the density of sea water is the density of sea water is more than river water river water hence it is easier for a person to swim in sea water than river water river water I hope you have understood the explanation. Thank you.